Most of them were written while traveling. But this song specifically was written from a sober vision. I've never really had a sober vision until I was at my grandparents' house and my life just skidded to a halt. And they are slow, simple people. They are so sit on the porch and let's talk about life and let's wait three or four seconds in between sentences. And it's and it was it was like jarring for me. And I I was Grappling with my entire life, I have been living in a very specific uh, way with ideologies and just, just I was, I was just, my brain was thinking a certain way. And I had this vision that I would go into this city and I would put on these clothes and these masks and these outfits and I would dance in the square and we will we'll be smiling and laughing, but then I would leave and I would peel everything off as I walk into the woods and I would just hang out with this homeless guy who, who just taught me what love was. And I would go back and forth. And why this song is called Severed Self is because it is a division within my own heart choosing to be in a situation where I do not belong and do not fit. If the doorway is shaped, not the way you are, and you keep entering, you are going to bend to break off pieces of you. It just happens. In this song, I was so at odds with myself because I was upset for choosing to go into that city and to be someone I wasn't. And this song was birthed out. I wrote it in about 45 minutes, and it's never changed since, it, since the beginning. If you guys want to do something fun, this is the sing-along song. So it's going to go, I'm going to teach it to you guys real quick. For the course, it's repeating, and we can sing it together. But it goes.
Father, pray. Well 